Hello and welcome everyone, I'm James Rose and here we are in the Heavenly Foundation sect. We now have a cute little doggo boy. He will be the star of our world. Um, his main meal is bear meat. Uh, and he has fire coming out of him. Apparently he was abandoned because he grows too slowly. Well, he is quite a small boy. But we will make him bigger. Um, he wants to practice his core. Yes, you can practice core. That's fine. You can also eat raw meat. That's also fine. Um, let's see. Yes, so I, re I looked it up again between episodes. It's Mount Full Moon I need to go to to unlock um, the sect. So we will wait for James to come back, which I'm pretty sure he's currently doing. He should be on his way back with the stuff we got before. Um, and then we can go down to Mount Full Moon. What is everyone doing? A lot of them are hauling. We do need them to do more hauling. We just have stuff absolutely everywhere. We still have tons of buildings we need to make. But we really could do with them actually clearing up all the stuff we just have lying around. We're also going to need a new storage area soon because this is kind of full. I might make a storage area up here and just put things in it that... Okay. Um, I might put storage area up here and put things in it. Actually, here would not be bad. In fact, let's do that right now. So, we're going to do area storage that. And then what we want in here are materials. Because this is relatively central for where all of our crafting takes place. And then we will filter out materials here. So they should all get moved. Uh, still need some more marble. We'll deal with that. We are in the process of making the iron bars we need. And we can't make the offcuts till we have actual marble. I still need to make this place bigger. Which means we need more ice crystal. Which we can get here. So let me start strip mining this. Well, it's not really strip mining, is it? Just mining it. There we go. Let's get the ice crystal out of there. There's actually more here. We could grab this as well. And that should satisfy our ice crystal needs for a little while. I can't think of any other, um, anything else that's too important than doing this. We have some here that's cooling this area down while it's summer. Once we're out of summer, we'll remove this. Otherwise, this area will get too cold, probably. Cool. So, they're moving all the materials up to there. So, what we'll end up with here are gear, misc, and cultivation stuff. Mount Copatoon. Run very fast and climb mountains with ease. Was that... I think that might actually be what we just... Found. No. Was that who we just found? That might be who we just found. Uh, I think James is back. James, you now need to go to Mount Full Moon. Go. Go camp there. You going? He should be going. I don't have the option to send him there. So he should be on his way in a moment. When he's finished having his fun here. He does need to eat and sleep. He, uh, we maybe should have let him sleep first. He may fall asleep while he's gone. I don't know if that can happen. Uh, so we started mining down there and over here. There's also a bit of dark steel. Let's grab that as well. Uh, did he drop off the things he brought home? He must have done. I don't know where he would have dropped them though. One of the things he should have brought back was demon hide, which is very... Yeah, there we go. Demon beast hide. So, yeah, so he has brought everything home. So, that is very valuable. We want to make some clothes for James out of that if we can. Though, I don't know... Well, firstly, I will actually want to... Cultivate his stuff? It's just... Yeah, so how much does that cost? Looks like it's probably 18 because we have 50 and that said minus 3. So we don't actually have enough for a single piece of clothing yet. 
James. Enter. Oh, he's not actually there yet. Okay. They can actually get too cold while doing this, I found out before. Yeah, in this cave, it's actually uh, minus 36, despite it being summer, because of the cold, uh, cold is it steel. Cold cr ice crystal, that's the one. Ice crystal, they're mining. Cool, so James should be here now, center. And we should be able to find the entrance to the sect here. And then there's a few things from the sect we'll want. Currently, mainly right now, I want marble. Uh, we can summon the pet, but unless he gets into a... If we find something dangerous, we'll run away from it, and then we might want to summon the pet. Otherwise, that shouldn't be necessary. Now, I'm kind of guessing, but I think we want to go this way. Well, it helps if you fly. Except, rather than flying over that, you're just going to walk around like some kind of mortal. Oh, that's something we want to stay away from. How strong are you? 1,000. Oh, so he might... James might be able to beat it. We, if we summon our pet, we definitely can. Okay, so you... Attack. And then James, attack. And there's no way this thing should be able to take out our dog. Firestorm, go. Boom. I did a nice bit of damage. Monster wolf, what people said. Figured I would leave my experience on this here. Had it spawned on one of the maps as a great evil lurking. If you managed to find this without pulling your hair out, congrats. Okay, first thing to notice is it starts in core shaping. Uh, fair. I think he, he, that guy's just talking about if this spawns on your map, which we haven't actually seen the beast that spawned on our map yet. How's the dog doing? He's still got tons of key. Yeah, so this thing is core shaping right now. It's like, like we are, but the dog's a lot stronger. The dog's more equivalent of like a golden core realm, but he's not very good at attacking, so he makes a great shield. I don't know why any sect would throw this dog out. It must be a sect full of gods for them to not keep this puppy. And there we go, we've taken out its key, and then it very quickly dies. And then finish it off. Do I need to finish it off? Butcher, go. Ah, uh, what do we get out of you? So, 15 more hide and some beast blood. That's fine. Excellent. Cool, let's continue exploring. We really should talk to people. I've got to say, that is something that could definitely be improved with the game, is the social system. Um, there's a lot of clicking involved that just seems unnecessary. And it doesn't make me want to do it. Okay, I think this is supposed to be the entrance to the sect. Have we unlocked it now? Can I assume we've unlocked uh, as our old sect that we can now go to? Let's finish looking around the map. How big is it? It's actually quite a large map. We may find another demon beast as well we can kill. I'll tell you to go over there. You should start flying, then we can just go over. Damn, this is a big map. I don't know what good there is coming to these other than just talking to people. And like, you, There are things to find occasionally. Uh, this will probably be quicker if I just do this. 
And then he'll unlock a ton of the top. Or she just fly through her automatically. Is there a way I can tell him to just fly places? Ah, frog. How strong are you, Mr. Froggy? A thousand again. Cool. So, doggo. Come get the frog. The doggo can't fly, so he has to run all the way around. He can unlock a little bit of this for us while we're here, though. Oh, unfog would probably be more accurate than unlock. Looks like there's quite a few mortals here, so we might be able to come here for recruiting in the future. Okay, cool. So he's upset the frog now. And now James can get involved and hit it with a firestorm. How much damage is that supposed to do? It says 700 key damage. The frog definitely didn't lose 700 key, so I need to under I need to learn how the actual combat works. So, spell power bonus, spell key cost bonus, but then I guess that is affected by any stats the frog has, which make it stronger against spells, or whatever it's however defense works. How are you doing for energy? You're actually almost falling asleep. I might just leave in a minute. Definitely worth butchering this thing while we're here, though. Having the dog is so useful. I don't know how James would do if he just bought these things normally. He certainly wouldn't be able to take out two of them because he would have run out of key during the first fight. Um, you don't need to be in battle anymore, James. Cool. So... Do, 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 do. What am I doing? I'm telling him to collect stuff. I keep forgetting where buttons are. Beautiful. And now we can unlock a bunch of the map at once by doing this. I thought the spirit soil there is not. Not that not the spirit soil would actually be useful to me in a map where I don't actually have my base. I assume not anyway. And right now I don't feel a desire to check out the inside of all the buildings. We do at least now have the map uncovered. Looks like the most... Um, the important thing was to find the gate below. That should have unlocked our main sect on the world map. I believe that's how that's supposed to work. I don't need to like click on it. Oh, visit sect. There we go. So I did need to click on it. I'm glad that I did that and didn't just leave. James is uh, making sure that the ancestors know that he has come. Cool, we've found the ruins now. Now we can leave. So we got some more beast blood and hide that can get taken home. We should actually be able to. We should have enough beast hide to make James a full outfit now. Uh, when he's back, we will probably leave. Yeah, there's the, the ruins are on the map now. Cool. Uh, when he's back, we'll probably leave him a little bit so he can get some of his key back and have a sleep and things like that. Although there shouldn't be anything dangerous out the ruins, so it shouldn't matter too much. How are you all doing with hauling? I'm still seeing a lot of crap out here and in here. Some of you are hauling. Other you, other people are doing other things. Oh yeah, the dog will haul. That's useful. The dog will actually do a lot of stuff like that. Which is going to be really good for us. Because he moves faster than your average disciple. Then again, Boar Boy moves really quickly as well. Boar Boy is super speedy. It's almost a shame that he's actually good at other things as well, so we can't just have him hauling things for us. Oh, what do you? What are you not sure about now, doggo? Uh, which bit is it? Uh, I often defecate in a field. Yeah, you can defecate in a field. That's fine. Oh, what was the? He's also recently organized items. That's fine. You can eat bread. That's fine. Don't attack buildings and you can practice core. Yep. All those are good.
There we go. He's gone and defecated in the field. That'll make the wheat grow faster. Following the dog around. Okay, what's James doing? He should be back in a moment. We need to wait for him to sleep and things for a bit, though. Yep, James is back. Hundred insects elder suffers from severe injuries that cannot be cured. Uh, recovery is only possible through a continuous transfer of power accompanied by a large amount of wood key. Any timely help would be much appreciated. See quest list. Task? Oh, damn. Ton of tasks. This is how we make friends with people, isn't it? I don't know, am I going to be punished if I don't do these things? I think I have to accept them first. I'm guessing if I accept them, then don't do them, I'd be punished. I can't do most of these yet, though, I'd imagine. A lot of them look like they just want pills, but I can't even make pills yet, so that's not going to happen. Uh, was there anything else? Info? That's not what I want. Expand? No, cool, that's all good. So we're letting people keep tidying up. Uh, we're going to wait for James to have a nap, probably. Because his energy is quite low at the moment. There we go, he's going to sleep now. And I might tell him to eat. Oh, did his key just drop? What did he get? Where did he gone? I swear his key just dropped. Did he not have more a minute ago? If you zoom in, you can actually hear him doing the things. That's cool. I've never noticed that before. Oh, hello. Oh, we had a love confession. Two of our disciples are in love. And what was the other one? Oh, and it succeeded. Excellent. So two people are in love now. They're going to have a baby. I don't think babies are in this game, unfortunately. Um, we do need marble, though. Uh, so James has had a nap now. He doesn't really need to get his key back, because I know that the sect... The ruins of the sect are um, safe, so he's not going to have to fight anything. So he can just head off there. And who's our best crafter? Da -da 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 -da. Work. Tailoring, more specifically. Only 27. 27 is not great. We want the level to be as high as possible. Now... If I remember correctly, I was reading this. So ability rating is how good they are. Their level is their like level of knowledge. So that can still go up and that in turn will put their ability rating up. The ability rating is based on the level and their stat uh, their um yeah, their stats. So these bits, I think. Or, no, sorry, these bits. Oh. I occasionally... No, don't attack our people. Cool, so uh, is there anyone who doesn't have a room right now while I'm thinking about it? Um, none of the original people should be without a room. You're a bit hot, that's okay. Ball boy, yeah, ball boy claimed a room. I think they should just claim a room if they're capable of doing, if there's one available for them. We've built all these, so we have plenty of beds now for more people to join us. Uh, James is still on his way over. Okay, this has been cleared out a lot now. This is good. We do need more of the marble, though, before we start building more things. Although, now that um, we've tidied up a lot, we could use brownstone to build some buildings as well. But I kind of like continuing to use marble. Keep everything looking roughly the same. If I had an excess, and also excess time for the disciples, I'd have them do the roofs as well. There's still more hauling they need to do. Looks like James decided to leave some of our precious beast blood just lying around on the floor. Often defecate. No, don't poo indoors. Bad dog. 
Okay, now that the disciples actually have additional time, they're actually going around cleaning. We haven't cleaned in forever. I think James should be there now. Yep. Now, this is something I'm unsure of. I know, in this location, there is an orb we're supposed to pick up. And my actual question is, should I pick it up now or later? Because the different guides I've read have told me some to pick it up now and some to pick it up later. I think the better thing is to actually leave it for now. Because it, I don't, the, like, it won't despawn. Nobody else will come here. I'm the only person that does anything here. And... Ooh, what's that? I don't think there's anything important. Decorative. Yeah. Okay, so we just want to have a big look around the map. Let's get the mini-map up so I can see things a bit better. And then I'm probably going to do what I did before and just go around the edges of the map so that then I can unfog it all at once. Then we can find the stuff we need. Although I can't help but want to explore the rooms. We can also get ourselves some cushions here. Although well, I don't need cu I can make cushions. I think there are elemental cushions you can make once you get to a certain sec rep. I haven't been keeping an eye on our sec rep. I really should. Ah, there's tons of marble here, lovely. Well, they're more marble blocks. Well, uh, yeah, blocks. I could do with just normal marble if there is some. Because that way... If we get just normal marble we can then make it into blocks. And I think James could carry more normal marble than he could carry blocks. Quick click, keep clicking. This will keep him moving faster. Because <laughs> I don't think there's a way of making him fly automatically. Damn it, he almost got there. And up here. Oh, there's a ton of spirit soil here. Can I pick that up and take it home with me? That'd be good. So once we've done all the corners... Where to here? Let's do that. Once we've got all the corners, we can easily unfog the whole map. Yeah, James is now the sect leader of this uh, this great and powerful Taiyi sect. Because uh, the original Taiyi sect isn't around anymore. God, can I just move my base here? There's tons of spirit soil. Cool, so we have all the corners now, so I can do this. I don't think there should be anything important in these bits that we're unfogging right now, just in the main sect. But we might as well do all of it. Or at least, I'm not going to like bother getting bits like that. Oh, look, a bear. Eventually, it'd be cool to actually... Um have our sect look as good as this, except not broken. Oh, I can get tons of marble here. Yeah, we definitely could do some better decorating in our sect. We're currently still just going for practicality. Can I steal the observatory? Save me building one. Ooh, spirit stone. I definitely want that. I don't know how many spirit stones you need to make a spirit stone block. A few, I'd imagine. Okay, that's all of the sect. I swear there's supposed to be some important orb here somewhere. If I remember, was the picture was of this area? It's treasure hunt, go. Hmm. 
James Rose holds a ceremony at the foot of the pagoda. Something seems to weakly interact with their key, which one is nurtured by the teachings of the Taiyi sect. Search. Um, employs a secret law of the Taiyi sect and discovers a strange object that in the hole that appears at the base. Blah, 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 blah. Hey, that's what we're looking for. Now, let, I'm going to go with whatever this says. So apparently this item is used to reduce the item management of storage, allowing any common item to teleport to where it needs to be and storing the common item. Oh, cool. My golden core can't open them. Maybe they have to be primordial spirit. Rather odd. Tier 12 artifact. I fought for the Taiyi and its people. Can you say the same? What is this? Keep it safe. Cool. So I'm going to take this because I think it'll be more. Like, I think what we could do, we could leave it here and then we can come back for it later. But it's more fun if we have to protect it. So <laughs> I'm going to do something stupid and take that with me. This is the legacy of Taiyi and we are now the Taiyi sect. So, we need to have it with us. How could we leave it here for some common bandit to what, come across it? And then I probably want some of the spirit stone blocks and the marble blocks. And then I think we're probably good. Actually, I'll see what quality of the cloves there is. I might swap some of James's cloves out if I can. Because there are a bunch of clothing on the floor. How good is this sort of stuff? Quality, common, poor, common, poor. How good is what he's wearing? He's wearing a thin bear hide shirt, quality excellent. And thin fabric pants, quality also, uh, quality common. Generally though, what he's wearing isn't bad. He is the sect leader after all. So I don't really need to take these clothes with me. I think all I really want other than that then is some of the marble and these we definitely want the spirit stone blocks so let's grab those and there was another one over there oh yes there's 200 of them there excellent i don't know what exactly how useful these are but i'm sure they're good and then i think we just want marble anything else we should be able to come back later for or we could oh there's tons of iron um Let's grab some of the iron. Just cuz we do need to, we do use a lot of iron as well. And then let's find a couple of large stacks of marble blocks. Think the ones over 200 should be fine. So, collect 241. And then there's a 220, I think, or 215 that'll do. This is probably more marble. Once we've got this back, this will be more marble than we ever had. And James's inventory is full now, so let's head home. There's more treasures for the Heavenly Foundation sect. We are basically the child of the Taiyi sect. I still don't actually know how I get the other manuals I need. We have a ton of manuals here now, but none of them are the ones that tell me how to use the other laws. So the next thing I need to do is learn how to get the manuals so we can learn the other laws. Once we can learn other laws, we might start, we might promote another person. Yan Lee here looks like she has the best potential. Oh, Yan Lee and Lee Yan are lovers. They're the ones that got together. Oh, but uh, Romulus has got a crush on Yan Lee. But Yan Lee is actually in love with Lee Yan. Sorry, Romulus. She's also a psychic, which is good, and a butcher. Uh, she's got a key sense of 28, which is not bad. Her stats are kind of awful. I wonder if I can do anything about that. I think we're too early in the game for me to be able to really help with her stats. It doesn't matter too much. As we go forward, we will get better people. We just need to... What I'd like to do now are the laws. I swear laws were over here. I'm being dumb. Still only have 53 sect reputation. That's good. Laws. There we go. Yeah. I want to get all of these and get somebody up in each of them. So we can get all of the abilities from them written down in the pavilion manual. God, you, you can actually do quite a lot here. I haven't really looked at. So establishing branches. I don't think we can do that yet. 
We also have diplomacy. Then messages, sector vent. Okay, so this will tell me when things happen. And this will show me messages based on if I care about the people or not. So we can definitely get James up to Golden Core, I think. I don't know if he'll be a good Golden Core. Um, if he is, we might try and take it. We'll at least then take him to Primordial Spirit. Um, if he's not a good Golden Core, we won't probably take him any further. We'll probably reset him to a Mortal and then try and upgrade some of his stats. Not that James has good, bad uh, default stats anyway. Oh, we're, ha we're finally harvesting some wheat. Excellent. So we can actually then use that to make some bread. We don't need uh, bread. Mostly you're just making tons of meals. That are, a lot of them are then probably going off. I haven't told James to smelt these for a while. Uh, we still have room on the training areas. Those could do with being inside, really. There's another one there. Let's smelt that. Still, we're still having our people train outdoors. We could probably have them training inside. Uh, Ball Boy needs a farming tool. We can deal with that easily enough. I remember where any of our stuff is. We just want the basic workbench, don't we? Um, I'm about to have a ton of iron, so we'll make that out of iron. We'll just stick that at the top. Oh, we do just need five normal marble. What is that for, though? Oh, that's to make the offcuts, isn't it? We need the normal marble to make the offcuts. Can we just mine some marble somewhere? There is marble over here. So, let's have our guys come and mine out some of this. I might, I might do in a second. Oh, look, look at all this. Let's get some of this as well. I might designate somebody as a miner in a minute. That's going to take forever. Oh, no. A love confession failed. Uh, we need another farm tool as well. Uh, we made one farm tool and we're about to make another one. So I'll get rid of those pop-ups. Now, do we have somebody who's particularly good at mining? Karen is actually our best miner. She's currently tailoring. I'm going to swap. Uh, we don't need any tailoring being done right now. So I'm actually going to swap her to mining. In fact, who's the next best one? Rachel, who's our smith. We don't need smithing being done right now either. So I'm going to swap you to mining as well. I want to get the um, all that mining done sooner rather than later. Gonna take a little while, but we'll get there. Be sure to prevent heat stroke. I will try. I've made everyone summer clothing already. Um do we have cotton? We don't. Just to make sure I have enough, because we also might have got um uh, What's the difference between thin and summer? I assume the summer ones are better. I don't have enough fabric, so we can't make any of that. The immortal cave at Great Desert has already appeared, and the secret treasures in it have been looted. Okay. Oh no, my animals are hurt. Why are you hurt? Heat stroke. I've already put this here. Oh god, it is really hot here. It's 45 degrees? That's ridiculous. Okay, we'll put another... Um... Where is it? It's under life, isn't it? We'll put another display here and put another... Ice crystal bar in this area. Cool. And then where is our... The ice crystal bars should have been moved up here. Yes. Place one of them on that display. And we'll try and cool this area down a bit more. God, I have... Thingy area is actually full. Um, Let's just, for now... 
we'll put another storage area here. Actually, I don't like it being right next to the crafting room. We need one square difference. This will do. And then let me check the filters on this. We just have material and consumables off. So we don't want material or consumables in this area either. The material area is not full, is it? No, it's not. Oh, Romulus is in a bad mood. Is that because he got... Um... Oh, it's scorching hot. That's not good. Yeah, <laughs> Romulus got rejected. Poor Romulus. <laughs> Uh, he he must have confessed to uh, Yan Lee, but she's already with Lee Yan, so he got turned down. Um, let's see, he is very hot. What is he wearing? He's already wearing a summer shirt and thin pants. So there's not too much we can do about that. He's just going to have to be unhappy. Rachel's also in a bad mood. I'm guessing for the same reason. Yeah, it's cause, just because it's really hot. There's not too much we can do. Uh, our legacy item is just sat here now. We'll have to make sure nobody ever steals that. Uh, we could do with this area being bigger. Uh, we should have more... I'm going to be ore. Yeah, we still have some ice crystal ore. Can we make that into ice crystal bars? How, mu how many ore per bar? Okay, only one. So we can do this ten, ten times and then we can make ourselves a much bigger fridge. Uh, we should also start looking at building some more of the sect stuff. Uh, I'm I think with the... Okay, here we go. It said there is a storage capacity per pavilion. So we'll need to build more than one of them. I don't know how many I need. I'll figure it out. Um, but for now, I think we're going to leave it there. So we now, we've now we actually finally been to the old sect. Uh, we've got the stuff we need from there. We have tons of marble now. So next episode, we're going to use this area we've cleared out to build up all of the sect stuff we don't have yet. Except probably a lantern gate. And a bell should be in like a corner somewhere. After that, I would, oh, oh we need pet stuff as well. Some of this stuff. Oh, we can actually build this. We can build one of these now because we got the, um, we should build the pet's bed. So we actually have a use of our spirit stones. Oh, it's so expensive. <laughs> I could use up all of my spirit stones to build the pet's bed. Pet defecation spot. Enemy pets can move. Okay, so this is all this stuff to do with the pet. That's cool. Um, Let's see. Herb garden. We might, if we're going to build a herb garden, it'd probably want to be down here, I think. I think that's how that works. In fact, what can I put in a herb garden? I've never really done this. Okay, so these are all the stuff we can't easily get otherwise, isn't it? So delete that for now. Uh, but that will want to be down here. I'm also hoping we'll have some more... Is that spirit soil there? No, I think that's just because of that tree. We have very little spirit soil. I'm hoping we might get some more when we've killed the animal down here. Um, I kind of want to go and send the pet at it. Because the pet is least likely to die and they might be able to run away. How much key do you have? Is it gone up at all? Not right. No, it hasn't. Uh, we might be able to send the pet down just so I can see how strong the monster down here is. If we also make sure everyone has a bow, we might even be able to fight it. Uh, has everyone got a weapon? Romulus doesn't have a weapon right now. Neither does Rachel. Ball Boy does, but it's not a bow. We should probably give him a bow. We do need some more bows. So before I forget about that, let's go to our forge. And we'll make some more bows. And for now, we actually have tons of weapons. But I don't really want to give anything but bows to our normal outer disciples. But anyway, that's all. I'm done. Uh, if you've enjoyed, leave a like, leave a comment, hit the subscribe button, all that jazz. Until then, have a very nice day. Bye-bye.